watching you drive Pretty all the way up the street with your head buried in the phone. All the way up the street. No, it was not. Oh. Imagine doing the Jedi mind trick, holding your phone in your hand, looking the officer dead in the eye and putting it away, telling him, no, I was not. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and pull you over. I have it on my camera. I have everything. And, I mean, and don't tell me you're on, on directions. No, I'm not on directions in my damn neighborhood. Do you really have nothing else? Being distracted in traffic is one of the main causes of traffic accidents. So no, he doesn't have anything better to do. He saw your dumb ass doing it dumb, because even standing still at the traffic light with your phone in your hand is, as it should be, illegal. You're gonna, you're gonna get pulled over. You're gonna pull over into the BP lot. Pull up next to the, uh, behind that. Yes, ma'am. Nothing else to do in your damn day, do ya? I don't want to be killed by you, ma'am. Pull, pull over into the pull over into the BP lot. Just call me a douchebag. Well, don't worry, officer. That's what you can expect from dick flutes, especially Karen-fueled dick flutes. Matter of fact, I would be disappointed if she didn't call you a douchebag. It's in their nature to project their behavior onto others. Stay in your car. Stay in your car. Henderson high with Robert. What the hell are those dumb noises? She should be coming from her car. If I were her, I would get that checked out. License, registration, and insurance. Can you please put your feet in and close the door? Why? Because it's for law? my safety and your safety. Well, you see my hands at all times. Is this against the law right there? Am I not allowed I need to have... license, Is registration, and insurance, man. Holy hell, she's like that annoying sibling. I'm not touching him. Look, look, I'm not touching him. There's still air between me and the finger. See, this is what pisses me off. She actually thinks she is in the right here. How, how come we have spawned a generation that can't stop touching their phone just for a few minutes even? They're like junkies. The moment they hear the bzz, bzz, or ding, their hand reaches out and they just can't stop themselves. It's truly pathetic. And this is coming from someone that has their phone on silent because the YouTube channel I run here uh, sends out a lot of notifications. But I can control myself. I've actually managed to not touch my phone for over a day, maybe even two days. It's not that hard. You're willing to text with your daughter in the back seat. Dude, I'm not texting. You I'm were sitting. typing and you look, there's a picture there and you're typing under with a green text bubble. I'm not comments texting. On a, comments on a picture. This is a little thing. Just okay. to let you, you know, know you're, you may be an Go old ahead, man. Jimmy. So I use this little thing. Okay, I don't need your insurance. I'll pull, it, I'll pull it up, ma'am. You me. are going to be issued a cite and citation today. And I talk in today. my phone like this. Mm, she, she was definitely typing on her phone. And even talking on your phone like that is illegal. It needs to be in a hand-free set. You pathetic specimen, you. Can anybody advise us? They're on a wagon permit. That's why we don't have a little wagon out. There's a wagon. My child's had an accident. I've asked you to stay in your seat, ma'am. Well, I have a child to attend to. 
I have asked you to stay in your seat. Can you please close? Is this, excuse me, is this part of the law, a part of getting pulled over? I'll is tell it, you what. Is it? I'm just asking because you're being pretty forceful about it and I would like to know. Yeah, no you don't. You're not interested in that at all. You're just trying to be a contrarian. And there is something called officer safety. If an officer doesn't deem a situation safe, he has the authority to change that situation. In this case, putting a door between you and him. But hey, let's talk about that kid in the back of the car. You don't care about her safety at all, do you? Bloody entitled brat in the front of the car. More immature, I'm sure, than the kid in the back of the car. The truth, is that a law There's that your drive. There's your driver's license, Can you license, answer that for me, Officer what Connor? You're being, what you're being cited for is Are texting while driving today, ma'am. Are you not going to answer my question? I'm going to give you a copy of the law today. You're not going to answer understand. my question about the law. What is your question again? Is this illegal to have my door open? It depends on my, my feeling of a safety, and you've been very aggressive for absolutely no well, reason. Come on, bro. You, you have a me over. Shut your mouth, he's not your bro. Disrespectful little twat. And you called him an old man. As if that is some kind of insult. What a pathetic display of a mom in this case. Perfect example for your kid. Good job. I'm, I'm not your text. bro. Exactly. Okay. Well, I don't care, I'm gonna call you what I want. Well, of course you don't. Being the childish little contrarian you are. Your small child is dependent on you and their oh, life yeah, is in her. danger. Their their life is in danger because mm -hmm. of what you're doing. You're endangering all our lives well, today, and that's why you're, you're being cited. Well, you're making an assumption that I was texting when I'm using yeah. voice to Well, ma'am, you can go to court on the oh, you 19th, to see me again. Yes, 9 o'clock in the morning, yeah. and I would love to there? play this for the judge. This would be absolutely outstanding. This would be entertaining for the judge. Oh, okay. You can go on the 19th at 9 o'clock in the morning, this address, courtroom 1B, to plead not guilty in front of a judge. Sure. Your second option, you can actually pay for it in person downtown. Oh. <coughs> Butterfingers. <coughs> oh, that's so funny. You almost made me laugh. But yeah, it's, it's going to be entertaining if you actually go to court, which you won't. This is your childish little mentality that is just, uh, you know, playing tricks on your mind. Because you can't control yourself. It's like you can't stop touching your phone. <laughs> Making us all unsafe on the road. I'll tell you what. You know what? Are you going to stop the traffic? I'm going to go ahead and give you a then? copy of the law today. I don't even need you to sign this. I'll go ahead and say I'm No, no, no. Don't do that on my car, please. Excuse me. That's my property. Do not do this on my property. Unwilling. Do you have any questions for me today, ma'am? <sighs> Plenty of questions. There you go. Are you going to stop the traffic so I can take okay, a left you don't down want here? It? Not a chance. Why? Do you have you, any other you questions, ma'am? This, and you know have my, a great day, ma'am. You know my daughter just had an accident. Well, at least she's uh, alive today because oh, because of me. Douchebag. I'm a douchebag. Your Honor, I'm a douchebag. I hey, will look on the bright side. She didn't call you a square, but then again, last I checked, it's hip to be square. What's that? She was still texting and driving when you pulled yeah, I know. over. Yeah, I know. I was watching she she got caught. She's still texting, and I'm the douchebag, and she's got a she's got about a two-year-old in the back seat that she's won. Yeah. She's just mad she got caught. Yeah. Right. Take care, guys. <laughs> Don't you just love it? Everyone hates these people that drive with their phones out. Imagine, imagine, imagine the brain part of this lady. And I use the term lightly, brain and lady. She gets pulled over for being on her phone, continues to be on her phone, right up until the point the officer is next to her car talking to... H how do these people function? They drive among you. Keep that in mind. Uh, bye bye. Bloody self-entitled... <laughs>